Have you been with them for so long? Bare feet are not allowed in the trains. This is especially important for the cars of your And we ask that you please do not run through the trains. Here, get me a listen and enjoy yourself. This does include our old cars, our vestibules, and our road. Thank you for complying with this. I'll see you on the trip. Say, G. Oh, Santa Fe. Great GSM there. GMSR. This looks like an old Norfolk from Western car. I was talking there, you got me saying SR. <laughs> <laughs> I got you talking there. Yeah. Luckily I have an arm rest, otherwise I'd be tired of holding your scan right? Have a great time, y'all. How are you going? <laughs> There's the announcer, the guy who's supposed to do the narrating. Huh? That's the narrator. Oh, the, the guy with the beard? Yeah. Well, the office, I used to work in that. I had a job working there. The out, it was an outfitter store. Outfitter, yeah. And then the offices are up there. I saw it before. The call center. I, I end up working at the Naval Hill office. Well, so. oh, I got fired for looking out the window. For watching for the train. Because, because there wasn't a customer. Well, I, there was nothing, no visitors. Well, people were on the train. By the time the train will come close up, straighten them. There's the well, great steam locomotive, full okay. steam ahead. Full steam ahead. I got looking out the window, you know, all this. Mm -hmm. I was straightening clothes, t shirts on, rags, and straightening I had rings to play, yeah. I think I was talking seven grand. I think it was seven times a hundred dollars, but I had to skin. That was a lot. I did. I went to see waterfalls and took pictures of waterfalls. Oh look, we're holding up traffic. <laughs> well, much, so it's a small town. Yeah. Was it, was it, six, was it 60 some miles? Yeah. 55. Oh. See, you're 55 and 57. They were trying to charge us four hundred dollars, but my mom talked them down to talk them out of it. What happened? Four hundred dollars for what? Mom is trying to get one of you guys a cab ride. I have no idea why. Oh, I thought the, I thought the cab ride was at Strasburg. Yeah, but she was trying to squeeze that in, but I talked her out of it. Oh yeah, we good thing you did we, because it's been a decent. Yeah, but you know. Just between us. I talked her out of it. I said, Eric's gonna have the time of his life and he's at Strasburg. 
<laughs> it's gonna be <laughs> one of the most annoying tourists they ever had. Hey, what is this valve? <laughs> Here's some freight cars. I wonder if this is the fugitive train. They do run freight trains. During the night, and when you pass your hand on it, it is operating a freight car. So they have several places to switch out. It's fun now. It's a great video. 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 They have fields and fields of tomatoes that they raise here. supposed to be at work but when he met me at Southbury
Wait, we'll be last. Big train. Oh, this is, yeah, yeah, this is almost 611. Yes. 44 miles.
Well, this is a good time to do it because there's no talking. <laughs> you don't miss anything. <laughs> there's no talking. Yeah, there's no more. Can't cut the dog. <laughs> Part of me wants to try it just to see what they do. <laughs> hey, you're not supposed to be standing here. You don't know.
negative in the writing speed, otherwise it's not going to go off. No, they, they said it was diesel, but I'm saying I'm glad that they didn't tell us what the speed. That would have been a rip off. Yeah, that's the one we're going to ride in here in Pennsylvania. This is the uh, first or second train we're going to ride. Uh, this is we're going to ride Strasburg, and we're, we're, we're going to have to get a tap for it. Yeah, yeah. We're going to have a three-hour tap ride. Yeah. That's going to be like a kid on Christmas Day, you know, like, like, what does this, what does this do? Don't touch it.
Wood, we can see him in our house. No, I'm, no, I'm saying wood, we can see him at our house. Yeah, I, I, I see woods and trees at my house. Like, yeah. If this is their biggest selling feature, we paid $55 for this. Yeah, and then we got the other just between us. I mean, not a week. When you said there wasn't much to see, I don't believe you now. Yeah. The hills were on the other side of the tunnel. Yeah. Yeah. Are we going to the flat road? Yeah. We're doing the whole trip.
I think the funnest thing for me to look at would have been the smoke if it was a steam locomotive. They said it's running tomorrow. It's running tomorrow? Yeah. It'll be going to your house. Yeah. How convenient. The day that we leave. Oh yeah, it's running tomorrow. Was it on the uh, calendar? Yeah, it was. That's not a good sign. If they're able to stop that little motor dead cold the way it is right now and then fire it up, there's got to be like a switch or something they have on that thing, it's just... I told my mom about I told my mom about the moonshine train and she said and she said I think I'll pass. Is that what she said? Yeah. Getting up at 8 o'clock in the morning to get drunk off moonshine. What is that moonshine Yeah, there is a moonshine experience. You get to you get to watch them make moonshine. I'm not kidding, unfortunately. This looks like the river has went there. And I think that's why the river's so low. Yeah. Remember that when my mom asked, how was the trip? Keep them out shut. Yeah, throw, throw away the key. They have 55 shopping places in Gillsburg. There's like 50, yeah, there's like a, a huge amount of shopping you can do. Yeah, just shopping alone. So it's like they take you to the middle of nowhere and then all of a sudden there's a huge city and they say, shop to your heart's content. <laughs> And then they say, guess what? You have to get back on the boring ass train. The boring. <laughs> or shop till you can't afford anything anymore. You know, no more toilet paper. Because. Yeah. That's what they want you to do. It looks like a shopping center. Yeah. How do you stop a runner from charging? Take away his credit cards.
time again for putting up with me. Well, I know, but I'm just saying for her, putting up with me. I mean, usually most women are like, why did I come on this trip? Okay, that's good. Just making sure. On the other side, or we'd be probably disappointed. See, the other side, I won't see the roof. I guess we said we're right spot. Yeah.
empty. If you want to, if you have any problems at all, you can talk to him and he'll definitely try to see what he can do. We have charged by the way, because you're nice. That's why they gave me that uh, first aid kit. Chugging it. She's chugging me. Man, she must be one to get a hit in the day.
Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this day ain't so bad after all. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I do. I got. The camera went looking each way. I'm like, yeah, they were. You gotta get Even in October, we still go top with the new whitewater raft. <laughs> Some of them are paying you $55,000 an hour to do this. You probably do <laughs> For that kind of money, just wear a parka, go out there. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. I mean, if you were getting paid to do that, I have naked. You'd be like, yeah, sign me up. <laughs> I'll scare away the rest of the neighbors and whatever else they got here. The uh, the uh, naked women that were uh, uh, drafting. I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. <laughs> yeah. Brandon, I paid fifty-five dollars to see topless women. Thank you. Oh, look at that. There's a new house being built. I was going to say that you look like you were. Thank you. 
You can never do that. I got three more minutes left to film. <laughs> I mean, three more minutes left in the memory card. <laughs> yeah, yeah.